Hello, my friends. Good afternoon. Welcome to another episode of Stephanie's Crafting Corner, where we get together every Thursday live, and I actually make something. Uh, we're going to do a couple shout outs first, but if you could do me a little tiny favor first, if you could like and share this video or like and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you're watching on YouTube, we'd really appreciate it. When you spread the word, it helps other people learn about the Stamps of Life, and we really appreciate that. Uh, good. I, I almost say good morning. Hi, Gloria. Hello. Hi, Teresa. Hi, Elgars. Hello. Hi, Joe from Wellington, Nevada. Why are you looking like that already, Kenny? You're you scaring me. Uh, Sounds like yeah, mine's good. You can unplug yours. Oh, no, no, no. We just did a test and it was fine 30 seconds ago. My hearing or what? You want me to keep going? Okay, I'll just keep going. Um, but we did do a couple mic, different mic checks tonight, so we're hoping that we're going to have no problems tonight. Hi, Ponce in LA, California. Hello. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Margaret. Hi, Mary Margaret. Ooh, I like that. Hi, Bonnie. My hair looks great. Oh, thank you. I got it done. Can you tell? <laughs> three hours. Can you imagine me sitting in one chair for three? Well, not cha one chair. I had to move back and forth, back and forth. But can you imagine me just sitting down for three hours? I cannot do that. It's, it, it is like horrifically exhausting just sitting there. So I'm trying to answer emails on my phone. It just doesn't work exactly right, but hello. Hi, Carlon. Hello. Thank you, Amy. She says, love your new hair highlights. Thank you, Janet. She says, we sound good. Yay. Hi, Judy. Hi, Sylvia. Hi, Terry. Hello. Hi, Ruth in snowy Michigan. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Lolly on Facebook. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Elgars. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the hair comments. Um, hi, Rhoda. Uh, Kenny, we got a spammer on YouTube. Uh, let's see. Hi, Kelly in Nashville. So I've been told that if we get spammers in our chats, that means that YouTube or Facebook or whichever one where the spammers are, it means that they're showing our video. So in a way, it's good that we have these dumb spammers. <laughs> Isn't that weird? It's like a catch-22. You know, you get these stupid, crazy people, but at least that means YouTube showing us. So I don't know. I don't know. Hi, Mandy. Hello. Hi, Ramona. Hi, Layla. Hi, Chris. Hello. Thank you. Chris said she reported and blocked. Thank you, my dear. Hi, Irene. Hi, Marie. Hi, Kelly. Oh, thank you. You're so sweet. Um, Carrie says you should have taken your rotating design board and colored while you were being colored. That would have been actually really awesome. That would have been fun. They would have all thought I was crazy, though. <laughs> I think they already think I'm crazy, so I think that would have made me even look more crazy. Mary, I actually do have a sneak peek tonight. Uh, we actually, um, you'll notice my tray back here is a little different than it has been in the past. Um, we uh, did uh, December videos today, so I, I don't know how much you know, but we always tape the month's videos for the products. Obviously, we don't tape the lives because this is live, but we tape all the videos for the month way in advance. So today we taped all of December. So all of my December videos are done. So if I get hit by a bus tomorrow, at least we can go through Christmas. <laughs> um, so yeah, so that's good. Um, but I don't know where I, why I even started that. So I don't know. I don't remember my reason for saying that. Um, April says, I take my colors with me when I've been called for jury duty. Good idea. Oh, the sneak peeks part. Um, so yeah, I actually do have a sneak peek because some people have been asking to see something and I thought, oh, this is the perfect way to show them. Oh, and it's a sneak peek. So it kind of works out both ways. So that's good. Jaylene says, I love sneak peeks. Yay. Hi, Quilty. Hi, Melody, my love. Happy Thanksgiving to you too. Very thankful for you as well. Thank you very much, Melody. We love you. Um, hi, Ellen Cuts Paper. Um, I, yes, Ellen, you have such good eyes. She noticed that my dad's bowl is gone. Uh, Kenny saw him on. Uh, what? We didn't break it. He did not. Yay, we did not we break it. We didn't break it. We did not <laughs> we break it. We passed it off and it was safe. Yes. So that's all we know. Yes. Kenny and my dad went to um, men's Bible study at our, at our church on Saturday morning for breakfast. They have a men's breakfast once a month. And uh, my dad said, hey, bring it to that. So Ken's like, oh, that is like. That is so stressful. So we packed it in the box they sent it from in and has all the packaging and everything. And so he got it home safe. He loves it. Uh, and now my fish is kind of alone, but it's still okay. Um, let's see. Hi, Lady J Crafty. 
Uh, hi, Pamela in uh, Missouri. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, hi, Chris. Uh, Ju oh, Judy, you guys are so sweet. That's very sweet. Um, let's see. Cute little th um, happy Thanksgiving turkey, Kelly says to you, Kenny. So Kelly says you have a good turkey. You are a turkey. <laughs> He's, he's doing other stuff. Wait, wait, sorry. Wait, I'm sorry. Uh, that's okay. What was your Kelly says that you have a cute little happy Thanksgiving on oh, your little you. turkey there. Yeah. He's kind of not showing very well no, he because of all my background. Much, yeah. Should I move this? Maybe if I move no, that. That helps a little. Yeah, but don't worry about it. Oh, okay. Well, I'll leave it I down now. I tried to put them on the other side, but the YouTube subscribe button is there. So oh. then he gets blocked by that. So, you know. Yeah, can't win. Can't win no matter yes. what. Um, hi, Susan. Hello. Hi, Patty. Aloha from Hawaii. Hey, you guys, first off, thank you all so much for sending in the spaghetti artichoke dips for Katie. She's been collecting them and I'm excited to announce that she's going to bring one of them. She's going to look them all over and bring one of them to Thanksgiving dinner for a test. So we're going to have a couple different taste tests and that's going to be our first one. So we're excited about that. Uh, Mary says, my friend Myra is watching for the first time. Yay, welcome, Yay! Myra. Yay, give her a warm welcome, everyone. Yay, Myra. Yay. Do you have your little clapping? If I had my sound buttons ready, oh. I would have done Sorry, it, Myra, but thank you for joining us, Myra. Welcome. Here we go. Oh. I did get one, yes. I did get one? Yes. Okay, good. A little late, awesome. but. Awesome. Better late than never. <laughs> uh, so let's see. Oh, Donna, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. Uh, I feel like we, um, uh, ooh, Patty Joe says, just got my order from this week's release and card kit. Happy mail day today. Ooh, fun. Yay, now you have stuff to do. Because it looks like everybody's pretty much freezing. It, it looks like he's pretty much freezing. Oh, uh, Quilty says, such a cute turkey. He looks pretty happy to be here. Yeah, right? He's happy. He's a crafter. He's, like, Whoa. he's a I know. crafting turkey. He's a crafting turkey? Yes. Oh, well, at least he's not going to be a Thanksgiving turkey. <laughs> oh. uh, have you gotten our turkey yet, Ken? Uh, no. You know there is a shortage this year. Have I? They say that every year, Stephanie. I know they, they do. They just want to get us all worked okay, up. Okay, so. but every year you believe them and you buy it early. Yep. But this time you're not believing them. Uh huh. And what if it's really <laughs> true this year? I have seen those Oscar Mayer packs of cold turkey slices. We just warm them up and boom, throw them on a big tray. Everybody will love it. Nope. They'll be on. This is the best. Can you ever. imagine what mom would say to you if you did that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, Let's see. Oh, Pamela says we're going to have six inches of snow tomorrow. Kelly wants me to remind you, please like, share, and subscribe. Yes, my love. Thank you. Hi, Paula. Hello. Hi, Terry. Terry says he looks like he's standing on your pumpkin. Oh, he kind of, oh, look at that. He kind of does, does look like yeah. he's standing on the pumpkin. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. Ken planned that. Not. Yeah, right. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, Chris says, any possible idea for a four by six creative decks? I won't have to redo all my Christmas recipe cards. You know what? We don't just because the box would have to be too big. I don't think, I mean the, the wood box and I can't even keep the one box in, in, um, in house and it wouldn't fit on the Heidi swap spinner either. So, um, I don't think so. I'm sorry. I just don't think that four inches, the six inches would fit in there. It just wouldn't. Ken, Janet says, you're too funny, Ken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm, that's what I say. Too, too Ooh, funny. Ooh, Deb says she's getting dinner at Cracker Barrel. Love Cracker Barrel. Love Cracker Barrel. We could get turkey dinners there if we had a Cracker Barrel. If we had one, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Barb says, when will the grass, watermelon, and Pacific ink pads be available? Early next year. Early next year. Um, let's see. Mary says, I love this month's card kit club. Can't mm, wait to yes. get it. Speaking of card kit club, thank you, Mary, for reminding me. Starting, not November, because that was yesterday, but starting December 15th. Those of you that have been around for a while, remember this. And those of you that are new, I will explain it. But, do you want to explain it, baby, or do you want me to? But, but, you do a better me? job. Me? Okay, yeah. okay, okay. Yeah, you'll do a better job. Okay, but Ken gets all the credit for this. So, I get the credit for <laughs> the, the stuff in the box, but... Uh, Ken has gone through the warehouse again, trying to clean up, trying to clean up, always trying to clean up because I'm telling you guys, it's a mess. It's never ending. It's never yeah. ending. It is. Because as soon as he gets rid of stuff, more stuff comes in. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's um, true. But, and it's, it's kind of fun because I get to, I'm the one that does the shopping. Like I say, okay, I want this many of this, this many of this, this many of this. Um, it's kind of fun. Uh, but starting with the December kits, you will be getting two Ken freebies in your club shipment box, the card kit box, two. 
Now, what is a Ken Freebie? A Ken Freebie is something that's been around a while. Who knows what it is? It could be a die set. It could be a stamp set. It could be who knows what it is. It could be something you have. It could be something you don't have. It's literally like a grab bag. It's probably coated in dust as well. Well, you should have somebody <laughs> wipe them off a little. <laughs> but it's just extra inventory that we have that we're like, well, what are we going to do with this? Well, we could donate it, but it's kind of hard to donate stamps and dies because like you know pe people that you can donate to don't really get it you know what i mean and so it doesn't really work so ken and i a couple years ago we decided to do this once in a while and we're doing it now where you're going to get two ken freebies now again it could be something you have it could be something you don't have it's going to be different than what your friend got you never know what you're going to get that's in december and ken said before i taped to the video today for december which by the way december card kit I heard a lot of people love the November. I know, I, I'm not, I know, I didn't even get to really talk about November. But let me just tell you, because I remember December, because I just did it today. December card kit, yes, you are getting an A1 card die, and it's awesome. This card video I did for December is like, how long was it, Kenny? He was like, uh, that was a long video. It went on and on. It did, <laughs> but I literally. It's fun, it's great. It, it's a good one, it's an awesome one. That's how good it is. It, it's a very I know. long video. <laughs> it is a long one. Okay, but back to the freebies. So you're going to get two Ken freebies. Hi, Carol. You're going to get two Ken freebies. Okay, you never know what you're going to get. It's a, it's like a, you just don't know. It's a grab bag. You're also, oh, oh, and he said December. And I said, okay, great. And he goes, but I have them for a couple months. And I said, wait, what? Does that mean like in January? Like how many months do you have freebies? And he goes, oh, hmm, four or five. So I said, does that mean I can announce for the next five months starting in December, they're gonna get two Ken freebies in each card kit? And he said, yes. So December, January, February, March, April, for sure, all the way through April, mark my words, you will get two Ken freebies in each one. Now, you never know what it's gonna be. It's a grab bag. It's like, a woo, let's see what it's gonna be. It's gonna just be exciting. Irene says we love whatever Ken puts in the box. Awesome, awesome. Freebies <laughs> yeah, are awesome, thank you. There's gonna be some you. surprises. Yeah. We find a lot of stuff around there. <laughs> I know, Ken finds a lot of stuff. And see, why do we pick the card kit boxes? Because, you know, we have that, we, we can do it on the weight. That's mainly the, oh, Renee says you are both so generous. Well, you know what? We love you guys so much and the, Best way I can tell you how much I love you and I appreciate you and I'm thankful for you is by giving you free stuff. Keeping my prices low and giving you free stuff. Those are the real reasons, the real ways we can say how much we appreciate you. So two freebies, December, January, February, March, April, at least. Five, at least. Could go on, we don't know, we don't know, we don't know. So yes, Bella says thanks in advance, I know. So also, Again, December will also have an A1 card base, $27.99 value. I know. Oh, and I didn't forget. And December, December stamp and die hard clubs will get a freebie. And card kit will get a freebie that's different than this one over here. So in December's card kit, you are getting one Stephanie freebie, because that's the brand new one, and two Ken freebies. I know. I know, this is awesome. I'm having fun. I love giving stuff away. Um, hi, Dolores, hello. Hi, Jeffrey. Um, oh, Jeffrey's so funny. He says, that means going to need more Totally Tiffany storage folders. Probably, in fact, I just ordered some today. <laughs> I needed more of the medium size. I'm like, I don't have enough. So I said, please send me more. Um, let's see, Ellen says, Ken Rock, Stephanie designs the most awesome stuff. Love you both. Oh my goodness, you guys are awesome. You are awesome. Um, Debbie, you need to contact the office. I can't help you via chat. So you'll need to contact the office at info at the stampsoflife.com and they can help you. Um, Chris, thank you, thank you. Um, Kimberly says, so generous. Judy says, wow, I know. So I'm getting, Kelly says, got to get organized. I feel the same way. I'm a little behind in my label maker stuff. I need to get Katie over here and tell her to spend like two hours just label makering. Label makering. Label or making. Does that make sense? <laughs> label makering stuff. Um, so yeah. Making so labels. That, making labels. That was my big news for December Kit Club. Do we have any baby news to talk about? 
Have they been doing anything fun, exciting? We had a couple dentist trips the last couple weeks. I think that all went good, but we might have yes. talked about that already, right? I don't know if we talked about that. Um, Jaylen wants to know when is the next class? We're still working on that. We are not quite sure. We are not quite sure. Um, Glory says, any hints on the next Fold It Club? No. And sorry, Faelene is not in the chat because Faelene is on vacation this week. And I will be honest with you, I'm never letting her go on vacation again. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course, but um, pretty much everything kind of shuts down. She really means it. I know, I kind of do. Um, Katie has been helping on the emails as best she can. We have been sending out a couple emails. Sorry, we don't know how to help you, but Faylene will be back. Thank you. She will be back. Please be patient. Um, uh, Allison says, I have 20 different tick, tick bags and I need more. I don't know. Uh, okay. Uh, Jeannie says, my stamps of life is taking over my living room. The more I organize, the longer it takes to find things. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh Eileen, thank you, my love. Thank you. Um, let's see. Uh, Teresa, you guys are awesome. Thank you. Um, okay, I think we got, I, I feel like there's baby news, though. I told you about Miller, um, I told you about Miller's sneezing. Oh, a really good one is they give a, the dog a bunch of Tic Tacs. Oh, and okay, yes. Let me tell that story. So... Ken gave um, the babies Tic Tac boxes, and they love white. Thank you, Amanda. They love oh Tiff bags. Okay, I get it, Chris. They love white Tic Tacs, the spicy ones. We call them spicy. They're like they're like wintry. Woo, winter green. Woo. Um, they love them. And so one fell on the ground, and my dog ran to it and ate it. And Miller's like, oh. So he gets another one and he gives it to the dog and the dog runs and eats it. I go, oh, you're being so nice to share with the doggy. I said, but you guys, you know what? Don't give Cookie any more because it hurts her tummy and it gives her a belly ache. And I go, what's a belly ache? And I go, well, it's a tummy ache. And they didn't understand. And so a couple more Tic Tacs just happened to fall on the ground and Cookie ran and got them. And I go, oh, you guys, okay, I know you're being so nice and you're wanting to share. Thank you for wanting to share. That's very kind. I said, but no more for Cookie, okay? What was it? Five <laughs> minutes later, I look over on the little rug that goes out onto our little patio. <laughs> the dog had expelled <laughs> the Tic Tacs and her dinner. I want to see the boys try to go pick them up or something. No, like shut up. Don't be gross. <laughs> so I, I, before I cleaned it up, I did ask the boys. I know this is gross, but I did ask the boys. I go, boys, come here. I want Nana wants you to see something. And I said, remember how Nana said that it gives C Cookie a tummy ache when she eats the Tic Tacs, even though you're being so nice to share? And they're just kind of looking at me like, huh? And I said, look what happened. Cookie threw up. And, and you literally, <laughs> you guys, this is so gross. You could see her food and you could see the Tic Tacs. One, two, three, four. Perfectly, because she swallows them like Miller. Perfectly formed Tic Tacs. No crunching. Just... No crunching. Mm -hmm. She just swallows them. So, yes. Yeah, so, Cookie cannot eat Tic Tacs anymore. We all know that it is definitely, definitely uh one of those things she cannot eat. Poor cookie. I know, poor baby. Okay, so yeah, that was a gross story. Thanks a lot for that, babe. That was a gross story. <laughs> I thought you liked but that. it was a good one. It was a good one. Okay, I feel like there's one more. Uh, bikes, no, uh, uh, uh. Okay, I can't think of anything. Um, we are having Thanksgiving at our home. Kenny cooks every year. Um, thankfully, uh, I get, to, I see, Ken's strength on Thanksgiving is cooking. I, my strength is to stay out of his way and to socialize with our friends and family while I leave him alone. Is that, would you, would you pretty much sum that up? Our kitchen is super tiny, so it's best if nobody else is in the kitchen, right? Yes. Even you. Even me. So when it's come serving time or getting the table ready, that is just your department. Then I need lots of help. And mom but usually really helps good with that. There's usually, everybody wants to be in the kitchen. Yes. Including the animals. dog, yes, both dogs. <laughs> yeah, they so want to be on the ground. It, I'm gonna it's have to put a baby gate up. Maybe that's oh, what I'll do. Oh, that's a, a good idea. <laughs> you should, because our kitchen is a U shape. That's what and I'll Kenny, do. you should totally just put a baby gate up. And then the only person that should be allowed in is Colin, because Colin's also yes, a cook. Colin can help. Colin is a very good helper for yep. Ken. Yeah, he'll help. Other than that, we should all stay out of the kitchen. 
That would actually be good if we did that. And I appreciate every, every, everybody's help, but yeah. there's just no room. Yeah, and our house is so small. We don't have like a living room, dining room. So we don't like, I mean, back at the dream house, we had like this gorgeous dining room. And so I literally could set the table the day before, right? Well, at this house, um, we're in the living room, we're in the living room, and then Ken says, okay, 15 minutes. Boom, we start popping up the eight foot tables or six foot tables and we put the tablecloths on and everybody stands up so we can, you know, cause you can't sit down and have a table at the same time. So, you know, we put the tables out and then we put the folding chairs out and it works. It works great. Um, yeah, it works. Yeah, it works. And then we're all end up staying at the table the rest of the time because you can't like go back to the couches because <laughs> no. cause, yeah, the table's in the way. <laughs> Once the table there is that is it. Yes, yes. Uh, Betty says I have a baby gate to keep the dog out. Yes, mm, we yeah. have one too. Yeah. Yes, yes, we do. We have one of those too for that. Um, cinnamon Tic Tacs. I haven't seen those. Um, oh, Lori says her husband cooks Thanksgiving dinner for her too. Okay, so Jennifer wants to know, will Black Friday include the 21st and 25th release together? Yes. So Jennifer, how we're doing Black Friday week is technically we, in the, a real world, a real month, a regular month, we would have a release Saturday night for the 19th, right? We won't be having that this month. This month, the rest, the last release we have for November will be on the 20th. Sunday night, we're doing a live release right here, same time, 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 Eastern, and I'm gonna do a live release and show you everything. However, there is no rush for these items. There's only one item that's a rush, and not all of you are gonna want it, so that doesn't, so it's okay, right? So if you're into stamps and dies, there is no concern of running out, no concern. So you do not need to rush to the website before I go live, you do not, if you're into stamps and dies only, okay? Just a heads up. Uh, you're welcome, my love. Uh, okay, so one thing, we put something new on the website, it is a digital download and I'm, I'm hoping Utah fixed it. Let me check and see if Utah fixed it because um, digital downloads are kind of like different for, um, let's see, let's see, Amy might be keeping up on it just to make sure that it's all good. Let's see, uh, quantity, come on. Oh, perfect. Okay, so we put together uh, for the creative decks, it's a digital download, meaning nothing will be shipped to you. Let me say that again nothing will be shipped to you. It's a digital download that you're gonna download and print out. It's $1.99 plus you get your club discounts. And what it is, let's do three on this baby. Yes. Um, what it is, is it, it uh, where did I put my dice that are gonna go with this that I'm going to die? Oh, here they are. It is for the original creative decks, shapes, and you are going to use the, the um, so here's the regular. Now you could use one of the ones that has the tabs on it, one, two, three, if you wanted, but I'm using the, just the regular one. And you can use the smallest layering die and look how you can see, hang on, let me hold this up. The lines go right on the outside so you can see where to line it up. And you are gonna die cut those and you can make a swatch book or a color swatch book. So for example, I'm gonna do grape really quick just so you can see what I mean. Now, because there is no shipping involved and I have to cut mine down because I'm using a smaller machine. Um, you, don't, you probably won't have to because you'll use a regular machine. But, um, so I'm gonna do grape. Here's grape right here and all of them are out there. Now, this is a digital download, there's no shipping. So you could just go buy it right now because there's no shipping, right? Also, it does not count towards free shipping because there's no shipping, okay? So here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna lay this down and I am gonna wash it down just because I don't want any problems. And the best way to do washi is this way, like put on your fuzzy sweater. And so I'm just gonna lay this down. I have lines all the way around, so I'm gonna line this up so the words are perfectly lined up. And I'm just gonna tape that down. Now I can run this through my mini, and this is the layering part of the die, okay? So I'm gonna lay this down, and I'm just gonna run that through. Easy peasy. So there's no shipping because we're not shipping it to you, right? So there's no shipping on it. And I'm gonna pop this out. So there is, it says grape. Oh, let me hold it up. It says grape and stamps of life, right? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the regular die 
This is the bigger die that this layers on. And I'm gonna drop this in. So what it is, is it's spaced out so you literally can die cut them all, boom, boom, boom. It, it's six, I believe it's six pages. Boom, 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 you know what I mean? And then I'm going to trim this down. Get it all the way down, there we go. And this is out of grape cardstock because it is grape, right? So I'm gonna die cut that. And there's a couple ways you can do this. If your printer can hold cardstock, mine can. I have that Epson one. It's on the Amazon link thing if you wanna go look and see which one it is. But mine can, you have to go on um, Google how to put cardstock through my printer, through printer and then put your printer name in there and Google will tell you how to do it. Google is genius. And whoops, I, adhesive. And so I'm gonna add adhesive to this, right? Now you could use the little tabs if you want, you know, the ones that have the little tabs, that one will work too. So there I have my grape. And then what I'm gonna do is I have some adhesive grape that has adhesive on the back. And I am gonna use my HSN uh, flower dies because I thought those were kind of like the cutest uh, and it's on my desk at the same time. So I'm gonna grab this little flower and I'm just gonna trim it down to make my life easier. And I'm gonna run that through. Now, do I have to add, whoops, do I have to add the flower of cardstock because I have technically it around the edge? Well, I am because I want to, you don't have to, because I want to. So there we go, I'm gonna add this. Now, you can also cut this out of felt. If my felt was nearby, I'd grab it and do another flower in felt. And you probably wanna pick a smaller flower than this because this one's kind of big, but it can also hang off the edge, which is kind of fun, right, to decorate. So now I'm going to make creative decks for all my colors. So there's grape. Now here I have the stamp that matches and I am going to, oh, I didn't even check to make sure I had grape ink out. Let me check. Kenny, you talk while I'm doing this. Okay, oh, big thing next week. Next Crafting Corner week would normally be a Thursday. Yes. But you all are gonna be busy with Thanksgiving and we're gonna be busy with Thanksgiving. So we are gonna do something a little bit different next week. We will be on Friday night. So the day after Thanksgiving. So, <gasps> what? The babies are supposed to spend the night that night. Uh, I asked you, remember, let's go to one. I asked you, I said, hey, Kenny, instead of spending the day with the ba oh gosh. <laughs> I didn't know it was next week. I, I wasn't Remember I said the day it. after yeah. Thanksgiving? Yeah, 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 yeah. And I oh. already said yes. We'll figure out something. You might be a one person show on Friday. Maybe you know I'll watch what? the boys in the front. That's what we'll do. We'll, we'll have Katie. I'll give you the switcher and. Yeah, I'll do the switcher here. Mm -hmm. You and Katie can be up there in the front with the kids. We'll or maybe just you. Somehow. Yeah, we'll make yeah, it work. Well, no, if Katie could come, that'd be great, because otherwise they're going to be trying to crawl Come back see here me, to, I know. Where's Nana? Where's my Nana? I want to go to the office. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we really don't want them to know that you're back here. We That's just, true. That's true. Katie and I will just have to run the show up front, and you will run the show do in the crafting it? corner all on oh, your own. Oh, by myself. Switch, and then once you prove you can do it, then I will be off the hook from now on on Thursday nights. You planned this. No, no clapping. No clapping. I did it in one of those. Psh, psh. Oh, okay. You punk. You planned that. That was excellent. You right? planned that. So I know you I did. I know you're going to prove you're okay, going to go come back to through. Three. You're going to be able to do it. It's going to be awesome. Shut up. Don't tell me. Okay. So here's my grape. Here's my grape. And I'm going to ink this baby up. Maybe we'll even watch you while we're up there. We'll put it on oh, YouTube. Oh, no. Because we'll they'll know I'm back here then. <laughs> no, they'll know I'm back here. Okay. And fun. I'm going to stamp that right Hang on, get my head in the way here. Right to, uh, I don't know where to go, right there. Whoa! And then I can also add a little swatch of my purple felt if I have some. Or I can use purple felt up at the top if I want to. I can have it like go off the side or something like that. But look, now I know what grape looks like. I can also get my grape pen in here and put a, do a swatch of that. I could do smaller stamps and dies so more will fit. The choice is yours. So it's only $1.99. Ooh, somebody said Ken can do Crafting Corner. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Yeah. So now yeah. I can put this in my That's creative decks. <laughs> Look at that. Cre yeah. Creative decks. Look at that. Boom. Great. And it comes with every color. Now, you're saying, that's great, Stephanie. But what happens when we get new colors? 
we will have free updates. So for example, we're gonna come out with two new colors at the beginning of the year pretty much. We will have, you know, give us a little while, but we will have just one sheet with the two on there that you can download for free. So, you know, because we're not gonna make you buy any more or do anything weird like that. So that's what we have. So it's $1.99, I mean, you know. What a deal. I know, well, I mean, it, and of course you get your club discount on everything on the website. So, but now you can do your whole thing. And I really like that. Okay. Deals and steals on the Stamps of Life website. There you go. Right. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> okay. So that is the Creative Dex thing that we just put on the, it's on the website right now. You can buy it anytime because it's digital and there's no shipping. Again, it does not count towards shipping. Okay. Moving on. We have, I have a card I'm going to make, but first I have another, I have a um, sneak peek. Let me put this stamp away. Ooh. I just kind of spit a little. Let me put the stamp away before I lose it and then don't know where it goes. Okay, so I was doing the videos for December and all my flowers go right here. I keep my flowers very close, trust me. Okay, so I, did, I was doing the videos for December and I discovered that Yvette had used um, the card stand. I think, uh, and Yvette, Yvette did use the card stand. And I know a lot of you have had questions about the card stand that was included in the, what was it, like the August Kit Club, Kenny? Margo. Uh, what? <laughs> was it the August Kit Club that the, um, the card stand was in? Probably, somebody Something told me. like that, yeah. Yeah, um, you know what, Tri Blends, um, the, uh, Crafter's Companion has a, a sheet for Tri Blends, in fact, I usually have some of mine right here. Oh, no, this is not the one. Oh, yeah, here it is. Um, Crafter's Companion already has one. So they have one on their website that you can get. You hearing screaming out there or something? Mm -hmm. uh, so you can, uh, Crafter's Companion already has one, so we're good on that. Okay, um, so Yvette used the card stand. This is what it looks like. Let's do three, let me grab a piece of paper. Let's do three. So this is what it looks like, well, without, without the little layer. So it's just this long die, and for some reason it confuses people, and so I'm here to show you that you're overthinking it if it confuses you. You're just trying to make it hard. It's not, it's very, very easy. So this is it, it's a big strip. It has a spot to fold it in the center, you fold it. She decorated both sides because it does have layering dies, so you can do that if you want to. Okay, let's go to two. And I'm just gonna open it like that, like a V. Ready, ready? And this, what I'm gonna show you in just a second, is a five by seven, five by seven card. It's like a postcard, it does not open. It's like more like a postcard, right? And what you're gonna do is you're gonna drop it in those two slots. That's it. That's it. Show me how you do that again. Okay. There's my card stand. So it's in a V shape. Die, right? See, it's in a V shape. You cut it with the die. Yeah, right? you just die cut it. You it. fold it in half. Fold it. it. has two slots and you drop your card there. That makes sense. That's it. Um, let me find, it even made sense to you? Yes. Woo! Okay, <laughs> so let me show you an example of, it's easier on, ooh, look how cute these are, okay. So, ta-da! You can put any card in there. Right. Wow. I know. It's magic. It's easy. That's great. Easy peasy, That's my nice loves. Stuff. Easy peasy. So you, if, if, yeah, so if it's not folded at the top, so if it is folded at the top, and for, of course right now I can't find one that's folded at the top. Oh, here, I'll pretend this is. So if it lays like this, you can either put them both in the front, so the card closed in the front. Takes you a second to get it, get it in, there we go. Both can go in the front, or you can open it and do the front and the back slots. So that is your option. I like doing just the front because it's easier for me, but if you want to go crazy, you can do it like that. So that's up to you. So um, for me, it's just easier just to do the front and you just literally drop it in there and that's it. Totally it around, so 100. Show us what it looks like behind the card, sure. There it is. There it is. 
So most of That's your it. stand is behind the card, right? Yep, the stand is behind the card, most of it. Okay. Now, again, if you want it to be open, yes, you can do that. You're gonna put the front in the front slots, the back in the back slots. Now I'll show you what that looks like. So there you go, let's do, um, let's do two. So there it is, and then you're gonna turn it that way, and there it is. Oh, sorry, flipped over, there you go. That's it. That's Yay! it. August, Russ says, thank you. That is it. Uh, can you put the Creative Dex uh, card in there? Uh, sh I bet you can. There you go. So a little card can go in there too. You center it better because I didn't. But there you go. Look at that. I know. It's pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. Thank you, Gloria. Yes, August. Will that die be eventually available for everyone? Probably someday. Write that down because I don't remember if it's on the schedule, Kenny. Okay, but that's someday. it. Someday is that under the someday section? Yeah, just put it. Just write down. Check to see when that's on the list. So, in the meantime, two sneak peeks on this card, and I'm not going to tell you what they are. Oh, but go ahead. Go ahead and move in close, Ken, just so they can see. So I'm not going to tell you what the two sneak peeks are. There's a sneak peek on there? There's two. Ooh. Two. Two? What? I know. What? And then see how she made this match? This is just a postcard. Yvette is the bomb. Look at that. Five by seven. Whoa. Whoa. I know. Okay, boom, done. Okay, moving on. Uh, sorry, I have to take a drink because my mouth is so dry. Please do not email Faylene and say how rude I am for taking a drink. <laughs> You guys. Okay. <laughs> don't, don't laugh. It's happened. Okay. Uh, we're going to make something now. Actually, we're actually going to make something. I want to, and I honestly don't think I got to do this yet. And so I'm making one today. I don't think, and if I did, so what? I'm going to do it again. I don't think I got to use the fancy frame square flip it. I don't think. I don't think. Uh, if you have any questions, you can email our office at info at the stamps of life.com info at the stamps of life.com or use the contact us, uh, the contact us button at the bottom of our screen on our, on our website. Also, if you ever have a shipping, a website order question, like you placed an order on the website and you have a question about something, you're going to want to email shipping at the stamps of life.com because uh, we don't do our shipping. A company in Utah does it. Okay, so here is the, um, the die set. And I am going to grab, and I want this, oh, well, first of all, I'm gonna use my hello, remember when, because it is so dang adorable. And I already know I'm gonna cut out some of the little guys. So let me grab this one. Now, by popular request, by popular request, the cutout pages, are solid on the back because many times people would say, oh, I love the pattern on the back and I want to use both. So this way you're not really worried about the back as much. Okay. And I am, oh, first I got to decide what layering pieces I want to do. Um, do, 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 do. Oh, this is rough, rough and tough. Um, I could do that one. Oh, the moose is cute. I, you know what? That moose and I just like mesh. I'm telling you, I love him. Um, is there a small bear? Oh, there is a small bear. I want to do a small bear. So hang on. I could talk all day. Okay, let's see. Uh, oh, is that the small bear? Is it? Is it? Is it the small bear? Hang on. That is the small bear. Okay, so we're going to do the small bear. <laughs> okay, small bear on one side and then the other side we better add in some color. So let's add in, ooh, the peacock. So we're going to add in peacock. Okay. So that's going to be my layering pieces. I am here to show you how easy peasy flip it's are. Okay. So first we're going to do the first die. That's the most important is the largest die. And I need to find a color that's going to match. I'm going to grab ginger snap because I'm kind of, Oh, maybe I'm not going to grab ginger snap. Oh yes, I am. Kenny, I need more ginger snap next time you go to the ginger office. Ginger snap. I'll put it on the list here. Thank you, my dear. Okay. So here is ginger snap and I am going to trim this down. I might be able to use this in my midi. Let's look, uh, grab a folder. Whoa, perfect, perfect, perfect. So I can use this in my midi. I'm just going to trim this down. 
gonna grab this and I'm gonna lay this down a little bit at an angle, but not much because it's barely gonna fit. And I'm gonna drop this in the folder and I am going to run that through. Oops. I do have a poll question tonight, Stephanie. Is it okay if I ask you? Sure. All right. Pop that up there. It better so, not have anything to do with Thanksgiving dinner. It does. No, 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 yes. no. Because that is my chat question. You won't think of this no, one. No, 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 no. No, oh. I already have it. It's already written, loaded, ready to go. It, but remember last time you, <laughs> you picked the one I wanted to say for my contest. <laughs> All right. And you didn't believe well, me. Yes. Here's our question. You got to answer the poll. I'll put the poll questions in the chat you'll be able to answer in the poll there how do you cook your thanksgiving turkey okay i didn't think of that see one. question uh first answer is you bake it second is fry it third is smoke it and the fourth is heat it up in the microwave mom and yeah. dad would say microwave <laughs> so i'll ask that one okay uh, that's on youtube so i was okay uh, that was approved that, stephanie that is approved babe so i didn't mess up your question right? you did not mess up my awesome. question Ooh. Acorns. I'm gonna use acorns. Okay, so here I have this. I'm gonna add, you know what? I changed my mind about the bear because he's gonna be too big for the bear I want to use. So I'm going to, oh no, I don't want to do that. Oh, I'll just use that one. Okay, so let me find that one. Oh, you know what? I don't want to do that either. Oh, I'm gonna get tricky. This is what I'm gonna do. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I am getting out my burlap die because let me tell you, I've used this burlap die more times than I can tell you. And I'm going to get out some adhesive sheets. I'm gonna put this on the back of my adhesive, uh, on the back of my pattern paper. Now, if you find yourself with extra pieces of cardstock, pattern paper pad, cardstock, and you're like, oh, I just don't use up the whole pad all the time. Start using the solids instead of grabbing a whole new sheet. So I could grab a whole new sheet, this is the wrong color, but I could grab a whole new sheet to do this, or I could use the solid in my paper pad and save this for important times, save right? Money. Yeah, save money. Okay, so I'm gonna lay this down, and I, don't, I do know that this can go through the, um, the midi, even though it's very intricate. I have the adhesive on the back, and I'm gonna run that through. And because it's so intricate, and this is my MIDI, which MIDI is just like, you know, a sweet little machine. It's not like a big, it's not a workhorse like the Gemini, right? The Gemini, man, that thing can cut anything. But the MIDI is a little soft. It's, it's just a little sweet machine. So I just ran it through twice just to make sure. The last time I did it, I did not have to run it through twice, but on camera, if I don't, it won't work. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to poke this through with my tweezers. What's winning so far, baby? Wow, it's pretty amazing. 90% is 83% are bake bake yeah seven so everybody talks about smoking it frying it well some people um but um, is, that, is frying it where thing. they drop it in yeah, the, the grease oil thing? yeah the big okay. pot of oil yeah so I always hear about those things but but I always hear about fires yeah but it's way more baking Way more baking. Which I guess we all have ovens, and yeah. we maybe don't all have a fryer big enough to we don't. fry it, or we don't have a smoker, so maybe those are the reasons. But I uh, always hear everybody talk, oh, it's so awesome if you do it this way, but mm -hmm. <laughs> they are in the minority for sure. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I want these to be the layering die pieces. So I'm grabbing the layering die. I've die cut this, see, I have my, I've die cut my burlap. I'm not gonna worry about poking any of those out yet. And I'm gonna lay this down and that fits right there at the edge. So some of these are gonna be just on there, right? It, the ends are gonna be like right at the top. So that's fine, that's fine. And I'm wondering if both will fit on here. I don't think that's gonna happen, nope. Okay, I'll have to do two. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lay this down and oh, I'm kind of thinking maybe I could fit a square on there too. Hang on, let's grab some squares. Uh, squares, squares, squares. Look at this. We got some squares. I have dotted squares, regular squares, stitched squares, scallop squares. I don't want to do scallops because my edges are scalloped. That's just like a little too much. And I really don't think I want to do dotted. I think I might just do regular because I don't want to have too much going on. So let's see which one will fit. Uh, the YouTube see. poll is still... That broken. was too big. Still broken? <laughs> give us the result, and then all of a sudden it showed double the uh, options. 
Oh. So you could bake it twice or fry it twice oh or my smoke goodness. it twice or... You know, you'd think these tech people could figure out some stuff, right? Oh, oh did you hear Ticketmaster? Okay, okay. Just a heads up, my website is not the only website that ever crashes. Thank you very much. Ticketmaster crashed, they said, over 5,000 times yesterday, which I'm not sure how that happens, but it went down. The important thing is the computer, their website went down so, huh, huh my website is not the right. only one that ever goes down. And I assure you, I promise you, I can guarantee you Ticketmaster makes more money than we do. You would think. <laughs> so you would think <laughs> they would have a better website. <laughs> but yeah, so Kenny, uh, did you read that article? Uh, I, did, I that, heard they had the some Swifties, problems. But... The Taylor Swift kids um, broke, the web, broke the internet. So what did I just do? Did you guys see that? I literally dropped those dies on top of my burlap and I made some layering dies. Dun, 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 dun. Hopefully this stays all intact. Let's see. Oh, yay. That's going to be fun. Now, I didn't mention yet, but I think this is going to be probably for a man in my life. That's all I will say. I will not say more. It's for my brother. Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm going to cut that out again. I'm gonna do the exact same thing. So Ken is gonna to talk to you a little bit more while I do that, because I'm gonna to try to hurry. Okay, well the last time I talked, I got in trouble because I said we were gonna do Crafting Corner on <laughs> Friday, so. Um, oh, what well, are you gonna say this time? I'm looking forward to the football games this weekend because uh, my players are in the fantasy football league were on the comeback. I was tied for dead last, and now I have moved into like, 12th place out of 14 teams. So I. Uh, Fourth are, place? Yes, we. Four, 12th out of 14. So I am moving up. I thought you said fourth place. <laughs> no, I got a ways to go. I got a ways to go. But two wins in a row, we're hot now. So this is. I knew these guys were going to play good all year. It just took them a while to get going. Isn't the year over? No, it's not over. When is the we're year over? We're like halfway through the season. Oh. So I only have like three more games to catch up to make the playoffs though, so I am running out of time. Pressure. The pressure. Every game is important. Must win. Must win. Win or go home, basically. Yeah. Win, <laughs> win or you're done. Yep. Okay. Okay. So, was that good? I didn't get in yes. trouble. No, that was awesome. good. Awesome. I filled in I am a little time. disappointed you're almost in last, but what yeah, can I say well, about I'm that? I'm doing my best. Okay. So now I just did the exact same thing. Burlap again. I'm grabbing the other layering die other layering die and I'm going to lay that down and I'm going to do the Whoops. exact same thing. So I'm going to just move that over a little bit right there and get my folder right there. And I guess I should do my chat contest, huh? Yeah. So I'm glad they didn't steal your question. See? Okay. So my question to you is also to do with Thanksgiving. If you have it at your house or if you have it somewhere else, do you get to have some leftovers? Yes or no? So like at my house, I buy the little plastic, uh, what do you call them, Kenny? Like Tupperware kind of things, they're not so, rubber made that you can put your leftovers in. So I line it up and I let everybody take some leftovers home because in all honesty, I think Thanksgiving dinner is better the second time around. Wouldn't you agree, Kenny? Um, you know what? He doesn't eat Thanksgiving. <laughs> Don't ask me. Yeah. Yeah. Kenny doesn't now, eat Thanksgiving. Now, what was your question again? I, so I my question is, it's a yes or no answer. Yes. Everybody is um, able to enter to win for a chance to win a $10 gift certificate to the website. Uh, the question is, do you get to get some leftovers for your, from your Thanksgiving dinner? All right. Yeah. Because I'm all about the leftovers. Yes. I can eat those leftovers for like four days in a row after. Oh, I saw a no. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, and it's my, I love, and Kenny never makes enough mashed potatoes, um, but I forgive him. And Marcella, my sister-in-law, has the best creamed corn recipe ever. And true. she always Very makes good. a ton, and uh, which is good because we eat a ton. Yeah, it's nice, too. Everybody that comes over brings something, so it helps yes. out a lot. That does help a lot. Yes. Now, sure. this didn't get cleaned all the way. Kenny, do you want to do this one for me? Because this is going to take me all day to what? clean this one out. Here, just grab it. I have to do this. Yep. And yeah. Oh, no. Okay, do that one really quick because this one's um, this one's a little faster. We just vacuumed in here. Oh yeah, we did. We had cleaners come yesterday. Like once every six months, we have cleaners come. Oh my gosh. 
It's like my birthday and Christmas they presents, but it's worth shop it. back and you just start. I know. <laughs> They're all, the is house. this trash? Is this trash? I'm all, yes. Anything you see there is trash. Tic Tacs all over the floor. I know. Dog stuff. My earplugs. I found earplugs under, <laughs> earplugs. Uh, like, everywhere because I have to wear earplugs at night because somebody, the guy that I sleep with, snores. Diet Coke cans. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys, this looks so awesome. Lucky Charms all around uh, the bed. No. Yeah. May maybe. Under the pillow. <laughs> Shut up. No. I've not found any Lucky Charms mm -hmm. in our bed lately. Lately, yeah. Okay, so there. I think I eat guys. them in the middle of the night when I find them. I go, hmm, Lucky Charms. <laughs> Shut up. You do not. <laughs> Dork. Okay, so I'm, I'm cleaning this one. I did. Did you guys also notice I did a square one out of it too? So I'm going to do that right This is there. very tedious, Stephanie. I, I'm, I know. I'm starting to lose patience. I know. Keep going, babe. Do you, do you have a pokey tool? <laughs> yeah, here. You want the tweezers? Here. Uh. Okay. You go. He's connected, so he can't move any further. Okay, I'm going to keep going while he's doing that because apparently it's going to take him a while. So I'm going to put these squares away so I don't lose them in my squares. And you'll notice on this, I have, like, oh, you can't see, but I have all of them labeled. So it says squares, and then it's like dotted, stitch, scallop. So you can see I have them all in there so I know where they are. Okay, go back to one or three, actually. Um, so here I have my cutout sheet, and the good thing for you is you don't have to watch me color right now. And... Oh, I love that moose. You know what? I was going to do the bear, but that moose is just the cutest thing in the world. I'm going to use him. So I'm going to gently trim him out just to make my life a little simpler. And I'm going to lay this down and I'm going to get some washi. Usually I reuse my washi, but I think I lost my washi. I've seen it um, stretched out all around the house on the walls. Oh yeah, stuff. the babies get my washi tape and they decorate the walls. So I could probably go and find you some. I know, and I go, dad, look. And he didn't know what it was. He's like, oh, do you have extra paint so you can fix that? And I'm like, no, dad, it's washi tape. And he doesn't know what washi tape is. And I'm like, no, dad, it's like painter's tape. It's just gonna come right off the walls. It's no big deal. And he's like, uh, okay. But yeah, I don't think he really believed me. I guess I should have shown him. Yeah. So I, he was like a little nervous. He's all, he, he was ready to start paint, fixing the wall. He I wanted to. I was some off the wall the other day. I was all, oh, I better go slow because it felt pretty uh, attached. T tacky <laughs> on there still. The yeah, you know, it's like that's going to be the one roll of washi that's like extra tacky. Okay, so I'm running my little moose through. Oh my gosh. I love him. I want to kiss him. I just want to hug him. I want him as a stuffed animal. That's what I want. <gasps> mm. Wouldn't he be cute as a stuffed animal? Is okay, Michelle we're going to fold, the... fold in half. What? Michelle makes the. Um, oh, no, stuffies. I mean a, like a big stuffed oh. animal. Okay, are you done? Like Thanks three for ornaments. Thanks, baby. You should use all those stuffies that. Um... Uh, first of all, you didn't get them all out, but. I it's did good pretty enough. good. You did, okay. And use those for Christmas ornaments. Oh, that would be such a cute Wouldn't tree. That be a good idea. I know the stuffies that Michelle makes for the from the design tree. team. The, I literally um, have them in a bucket, a bin for the babies to play with. So they how many love, winners do are we picking tonight? Oh, three. Three winners. Yeah. So go ahead and pick some winners because I I'm forgot we did that. It. I had to get all those little um, oh. things out. So yeah. Kind of slow things but down. dude, this is worth it. Look mm -hmm. at that. Oh my goodness, you guys, that looks awesome. Okay. So there is that. And now, oh, that's a lot of blue. Oh, that's a lot of blue. Oh, that's a lot of blue. Uh, that's too much blue. Okay, hang on. Let's see what we're going to do with this guy. And I want him to hang like right there. So I'm thinking when I open it, it'll go like that. But look at that. Look at that. That's a problem. It's red on the back. So what we're going to do is we're going to find the other one and we're going to do, we're going to die cut that one out too. Um, I was going to say something, but that blue is way too much blue on there, so we got to figure that out too. I think we're just going to put a solid on there. I think we'll go back to that solid blue. Oh, did I use it all? Oh, pooey. Okay, hang on. One thing at a time. Okay. So we're going to cut out another moose. Are there people still watching? I'm not sure. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. I feel like I'm being boring. Yeah. Okay, so, but this moose is too dang cute. Okay, so I'm laying this down. And I'm going to trim him out. Okay, and we're going to run him through. Okay, make sure you guys, you ask for a Stamps of Life gift certificate for the website because you guys, 2023, it will knock your socks off, literally. 
great Christmas gift for you or to give to somebody. A loved right? one, you know? yes. A loved one. <laughs> <laughs> like yourself. Buy one for yourself. Okay, so I got to fix this issue with the blue here. It's not happening here for me. So what are we going to do? We are going to use... Oh my gosh, I totally thought about something else. Hang on. Um, we have... I wonder if this will fit on there. Yes! We have this really cool Fanks vertical die. I hope we still sell it um, that I'm going to use. But in the meantime, I need to add some color. I'm going to add some red. Let's add some of that poppy. Um, okay, Kenny, are you going to pick some winners for us? I do baby? have our winners. You ready? Yes. Oh, the poppy's on Our this. first winner. These winners each get a $10 gift certificate to the Stamps of Life website. Our first winner is from YouTube, and she said, everybody said yes tonight, just about. Yes, it's Nubia Nicholas. And then our next winner, also from YouTube, she said yes, is Christine O'Brien. Yay. And then Yay for our, the first one. Sorry. Excuse me? Sorry, I said yay for the first one because I didn't like say yay before. So. Oh, yeah. I'll yay, yay, a, yay. I'm going to give them a crowd cheer. Okay. I've got it ready. Okay. And then our last winner is from Facebook. She also said yes. It's Kathy Creeley. So yay, awesome. everybody. Good yay. job. Yay. You three just won a $10 gift certificate to the website. You are going to email Faylene at info at the stamps of life.com. You will not hear from her tomorrow. <laughs> you will not hear from her over the weekend. Oh, by the way, Faylene does not work on the weekends. So this is really going to touch your guys' patience. You so know. yes, <laughs> she will get back to you as soon as yes. she can. First thing next week. Um, it, she's answering emails in the order they came in. So, um, oh, you want to know a funny thing is if you email us again and say, Hey, you didn't answer my email. You know what happens? Oh, sorry. You know what happens is because she answers them from the oldest, she goes in, you know, from oldest first, right? Um, if you email again saying, hey, you, you didn't answer this email, well, then it goes to the top. Oh, and then you have to And because it goes by the last email you sent. So oh. just, just be, please be patient, especially since she's on vacation. But she deserved the vacation. She really did, you guys. And so. <laughs> Um, and it proves to her and is job security for her because she knows that we're never, ever, ever going to let her leave us. Um, ever. Ever. <laughs> uh, because we need her. Uh, so uh, just be patient. But she will get that um, $10 gift certificate out to you as soon as possible, which is very exciting. And I do not let her work on weekends. So she will get back to you early next week. Jassy says thank you. Oh, you're welcome, my love. Yay, enjoy it. You're going to have so much fun with it. Because then you get to get whatever you want. Okay, so I'm at, I'm just going to really quick, I'm trying to finish this off of you guys. Um, finish up strong. I know, I'm trying. Okay. And then we'll do some questions here in a few minutes. Yes. So if you have questions, make sure you get those ready. We'll finish up our night with questions. Okay, I'm cutting out two because I have a feeling I might use both. And... Um, let's see, maybe I won't. I'm trying to go fast. I'm trying to go fast. Could you use this moose with the moose mountain? Sure you could. It would work, right? Yeah, it would. That would look cute. Hang on, that didn't like go all the way through. Must have been a speed bump. Okay, so let me get this on the front. And I haven't figured out what's going to happen on the other side. Okay, so there's a square. And haven't figured that out. Oh, but I got to do, ooh. You know what? I'm going to add white. So let's look at this on three, Ken. Uh -huh. So what I'm doing here is I'm looking at the colors and I'm thinking, okay, I need to add in the actual word thanks, right? I have my moose that's going to go literally off to the edge, off to the side like this. And so when he opens it, that's going to stay there and it's going to open like that, right? But you'll notice I have a lot of white here. And wow, that's a lot. So there's a couple things I'm gonna do first. First, I am going to get some ink blending brushes and I am going to get the Sua Ginger Snap ink pad. Shut up, give me that, give me that. You are a jerk. <laughs> you know, you know, you know, you're a jerk. Ken is reminding me that I made this one last week. Show them. I did. I put it in the cam in the shot next to this one. Okay, this is proof I love the burlap one. What can I say? What can Everybody's I say? Everybody's all. This looks really familiar, Shut up. Stephanie. No, they did not say that. <laughs> they did not say that. You're saying that. Okay, so I am getting my. 
and it watch gets this. Boing. Sure, fine, shut up. I'm just gonna be, to go fast, I'm just gonna go over the whole thing because Ginger Snap's really not gonna show on the dark of the mousse. And I'm just going over that white because, woo, that white was bright, wasn't it? It is a beautiful Beecher bright says, white. color the edge. Yes, bright, bright white. Yeah. And so I Make don't need to worry about bit. just the edge because this, this color is the same color. So I'm just going over the whole thing. Now, I want you to see the difference. Look at this, and I'm gonna hold it up so you can really see. But look at the difference, right? What? I know that white is like blinding, isn't it? So yeah, we definitely want to do this for both because it just makes him a little bit less bright because we want it to be more muted, right? And we love him. Now everybody loves the burlap, Stephanie, just because yes. you love it so Shut much. Shut up. <laughs> no, it's an awesome dye. Okay, so I, I hope you even have him on the website. Okay, whatever. Anyway. There's my two little guys, much better looking. So now I don't necessarily need to use white because I was gonna use white for this. So let's introduce another color and let's do chocolate brown. Yay, chocolate so This is brown. gonna be like a series of burlap. Um, yeah, last burlap. Week we had the burlap A2, this week we have the burlap, burlap flip, flip it. it. Yeah. Next year, we'll, next month we'll have to do a burlap fold it somehow yeah right just keep it in <laughs> five by seven burlap it's just gonna be all burlap all the time burlap all the time to life yes okay so we're gonna die cut this out of the chocolate this thanks die is fun if you can't find this thanks die just search thanks and it should come up okay so i'm die cutting this one almost done and oops getting that oops there it is now let's pop this baby out. Oh, you have my tweezers still. Baby, you have my tweezers? Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. I swiped them. Swiper, oh, don't throw those. Those Ooh. suckers are sharp. Ooh. Okay. Okay, so I'm yanking that there, and I'm getting this right here. And I'm going to add this. Don't forget to like and share this video. And if you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe. Um, Facebook and YouTube like when people watch and then they actually like say they like it. And <laughs> if you share it, that is even better for us. That like really helps us. And um, you know, it's easy for you, right? You just have to click a couple so buttons. So easy and it helps us so much, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put my little guy there and I'm gonna add adhesive to this. Now we gotta figure out what we're gonna do on this one section here. Oh, look, I got blue all over me. Okay, so I'm gonna lay him right here. And see how he's hanging off? So watch, oh, you know what? His little head gets messed up there, hang on. Luckily, this is more forgiving. He's gonna go, oh, let's see. Uh, I'm not liking this. He didn't do this earlier. Okay, let's see, let's try that. Oh, I don't like that. Should have picked the bear. <laughs> but that moose is so cute. I Lisa. know, that's my problem. Aww, he's uh, so cute. Uh, I mean, now you want to get rid of him. I know. Now he's dead to me. No, I'm kidding. Okay, hang on. Let's try this. There we go. Okay. So we're adding that. Now, even if it's sticky on the other side, that's okay, because watch this. See, I don't want this red on the back. Sorry, I got the pink in there still. So what we're going to do is we're going to add adhesive to this one. And we are going to add this one right on top. There we go, so you don't see that red. And then, watch this. Ready, watch this. Woo, 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 woo. Now, here's a problem. We, need to we have to finish something here. And I've thought about, I found these cute acorns. And ac oh my word, look at that. That's perfect right there, boom. Look at that. So there's my front, and then I'm gonna open up, it says thanks, and I need like a little thank you stamp that just says, hey, thanks. Thanks. So, like a small <laughs> thank little thank you stamp thanks. that says thanks, that would be awesome. I know, right? Um, uh, oh, look at that, boom, thank you, right there. Oh, yes. Okay, so what, well, this is friend phrases for HSN. I hope it's on the website, okay. So let's grab a block. Let's get some, you know what? My licorice ink is over there. Let's get a different color. Let's 
nuts. Oh, pet mail, that's not gonna work. Oh, chocolate, there we go. I'm gonna have to put the timer on right now. I know, I'm almost, down. <laughs> I'm almost done. I'm almost done, I'm almost done. I know, I'm almost done. Okay, so chocolate, stamp, thank you. Stamp it right, barely there. Thank you. Okay, awesome. boom, done. Check it out. Mm. Ready? Whew. So here we go. There's my cute little moose. We're going to open it up. Thank you. And it says, thanks. Nice and large. Nice large card, and in charge. Stephanie. Thank we you. We give you an applause. Oh, right thank you. Yeah. You did it. Last week? This week. <laughs> Two different ways to do the burlap dye. Apparently, that is it's... why I'm here. November is the month for burlap. Yes, apparently it is. Oh, and I could even get crazy and I could like add a little, you know how I did this on the inside? I added those two little pieces. I could do that nice. somewhere too. Could just add it like up there or something, but I won't because we're done. Okay, right. boom, there, there we're done. Whew. Okay, now is our time for questions. Question. So if you asked in a question and we just didn't see it because the chat goes so fast sometimes and I usually have to look down to see what I'm doing. Um, not always, but usually I try to look down to see what I'm doing. Uh, so if you have any questions, uh, Faleen was not on the chat today because Faleen is on vacation. Um, a very well-deserved vacation. Yep. She earned it. So. Yeah, she earned it. Um, I'm never letting her leave me again, but whatever. Okay, um, let's see. Thank you. We need more vertical dies, please. Yes, I know. That one's really fun, isn't it? I love that one. Um, let's see. Uh, why can't you take the entire Thanksgiving weekend off? Oh, Mary, I like it. Listen to her. She says, Ken and Stephanie, I have a question. Why can't you take the entire Thanksgiving weekend off? You deserve it. Mary, you are so sweet and so kind. <laughs> Thank you. Nice. That was so nice. In all honesty, um, we like doing this. So to us, it's not really work. Um, I know technically it would be classified as work, but we have so much fun and we love to spend time with you guys. And I'm not saying that like to be cheesy or anything. I'm serious. So, I mean, it's like kind of like, well, where else would we want to be? So, but thank you for saying that. That was really kind. Um, let's see. Um, Jackie says, how big can the cards be for the pink Rolodex? Like when you turn the handle, how big is it from the table to the bottom of the Rolodex? Um, can you, do you, can you hand, reach that sample Rolodex that's over there? I have a sample one down there on the floor, I think. The pink um, Heidi Swap one that's out of stock again, by the way. Um, it, I think it's down down here around the corner underneath. I can't reach it from the side. He, I'm going to see if he can find it. He might not be able to reach it. He's, he's, he's attached in too many places. So let's see. Um, Linda says, will you have more, will you be having more uh, different digital files for the Creative decks? Yes. So the plan is, and we're working on it, um, this one was just kind of like our little test to, thank you baby, uh, our test to see, um, you know, make sure it works and things like that. But yes, the plan is to do more digitals. Okay. For I'm like the, in the trash. oh yes, Ken found some, Ken came home the other day. How many did you find baby? There's like six of them I think. He comes home with these little bins. And I go, where'd you get those? And he goes, I found them in the trash. So he's like, you could probably use them. Outside of the trash can, though. They were outside of the trash can, at least. Somebody wanted me to take them. Somebody wanted <laughs> you to take them. OK, so let's do this question here. Um, I am estimating uh, approximately uh, three and a half inches tall three and a half inches tall. So to give you a, let's see, to give you an example. Oh, this one's three and a half inches. So let's see. Oh, that's not going to work. Uh, oh, actually I could die cut it. That was, duh, I could die cut it. So let's try this really quick. So let's just run this through really quick. Look, at, look for other questions, Kenny, while I'm working on this one, if you can see any. Okay. Um, Where'd it go? Uh, what was the die set that she used tonight? I saw that one a little bit. Oh, uh, the woodland, uh, woodland guys, woodland to and stamp. And with a burlap background. Oh, burlap right? background. Okay. Yes, burlap background. And let's see. Uh, I see a lot of prayer requests coming in, so I am. Oh, writing good. Those Ken's down. writing those down, you yeah. guys. So if you do have any prayer requests, please do add them. We'll be watching for them. I'm trying to write them down as we go through. 
Um, Easy. Someone said they were having problems downloading the um, little thing that you talked about tonight that they can download, so we might want to check that. It, they said it was just spinning. We'll have to test it. Oh, ourselves. okay. You know what? It could be too many people on there, but um, if you can't do it in the next, like within the next hour or so, um, let us know and we'll look into it. But look, that. yeah. Okay. So this one fits, and this one looks. It looks like it still have. It has like a good, you know, quarter of an inch. I don't know how much you would really want it to go over that. So this is the large one, and this is three and a half inches. Three and a half inches. And Missy wants to know, have you ever used any of your dyes to make ornaments? I guess since we were talking about that. We yeah, ha I have. Um, I've done the original snow globe that we did. I made that an ornament. I've done a lot. Um, I haven't gotten my Christmas stuff out yet, so I'm not going to remember right off the bat which ones I've used. Um, oh, the gingerbread men. Used the gingerbread men before as ornaments. Um, let's see what I'm thinking off right off the top of my head. Um... I can't think of any off the top of my head other than those that I have used to make ornaments. Uh, yeah, I think that's it on those. Okay. And then, uh, let's see. How do you get your midi not to stick to the table? Uh, not to stick to the table? Um, I have um, paper. I have craft paper on my desk. It's a roll of craft paper I bought online, so whenever it gets dirty, I don't want to use that my real, I think this is butcher block, it's covered with so much rounds of paper, I don't remember, I think it's butcher block, but I don't use that because I don't want the stains, the ink to ruin it. So I always use uh, craft paper, a roll of craft paper, and we change it out every once in a while, and it doesn't stick. Um, it does stick to like my secret weapon though. Um, I guess if you don't want it to stick, um, maybe tape them down or something. I don't know, put, put um, scotch tape on top of them or something. So, oh, Myra, you're so sweet. She said, it's nice of you to treat us like we are family. You are. Oh, the stocking. Thank you, Kathy. Yes, I've used the stocking fold it lots of times for, um, for ornaments. So this cutting page is going in with my woodland guys because I want to make sure I can find it when I want to use it next time. Okay, uh, let's see. Any other questions? Uh, um, Ramona wants to know what size was the card base that you used tonight, Stephanie? A2. Four and a quarter by five and a half. A2 in size. Normal card size. Good question, though. Uh, gingerbread fold it, yep, to make ornaments, yes. Um, will a moose be a fold it someday? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's on the list, but unfortunately, um, I think on fold it's, I'm booked through. I think I, st I started filling up Christmas time. This is 2022. I started filling up Christmas 2024 schedule because um, I always have so many ideas for the folded. I have a question for you okay. here. Um, any tips or tricks for the create a scene celebrate card die set? Sometimes I can't get it flat. Makes the cutest card. Um, Rosemary, what I do is I add adhesive to the one side to like the left side first and I fold my card flat. So I have my card flat and I hold it down and then I glue it down to the one side and then I really press down and then I add adhesive to the bottom on the other side and I just lay it flat down so then when it opens then it's already straight. I hope that helps. Um, will the download include the older colors too? Debbie wants to know. Um, no. And why is that? because uh, we were concerned, then we would get too many emails saying, well, I don't have mustard, I don't have corn flour, I don't have, um, those colors are the ones we came out with the other company, with Colorbox, when we used to do these. And so um, we're not doing those just because, um, we're not, sorry, we're not, because uh, we get too many people mad at us that we don't have them still. <laughs> We can't win no matter what. <laughs> um, Kathy says, have a blessed Thanksgiving to you and your family. We are thankful for you both. Wow, Kathy. Thank you. Thank you. I'm thankful for you. We're going to um, we're gonna have a bill oh, next Sunday, this coming Sunday, we are being a, doing a live release for our Black Friday week. And let me tell you, it is going to be amazing. So make mm. sure you join us this Sunday, 5 p.m. Pacific, yes. 8 p.m. Eastern. And I'm gonna demo all the items live. I'm gonna show them all off to you. There's no rush to purchase all any of the stamps and dies and uh, the other stamps of life item. You are totally, you don't have to worry about the quantity, 
okay? You can just walk, don't, you don't even buy anything yet until after you see my demo. Then you can go buy and you don't, you, you could buy on Sunday or Monday easily because I have enough and it, I, everything should last through the whole week. I just don't know if it will. But my, Sunday and Monday, you're gonna be totally fine. Are you allowed to say how many items there are, will be for Black Friday, Stephanie? Or is it top secret? It's top secret. Oh, yeah. More than five. Less than ten. Uh, Peggy says, is it too late to join the Fold It Club or can you join at any time? Peggy, good question. You can join at any time. But here's the deal. If you want the B, and I had a copy of the B still here, but I lost him now. He's gone. If you want the B, Fold It. You must sign up before the 23rd. Once we switch to the next month, that is it, right? Because once we switch on the 24th to the new one, the bee is gone. It will fly away. It will not be on the website for at least 15 months. It will fly away. So if you want that bee, sign up before the 23rd. Okay? If you don't like the bee, which that would be crazy, but if you don't, you want to start with the next one, then you can so sign up after the 24th, 24th or after. Now, the B, don't forget, is our first one ever. It's our first one. So if you got the B in the Fold It Club, that means when I talk to you in a year or something, you can say, I'm an original Fold It Club member. I have the, the B. I have the B. <laughs> Not very many people are going to be able to say, you know, in, two, in a year that they have the B. Just saying. So, oh, but one. yes, you can join. Just um, did you show the sneak peek for the month? I did. I did. Can you show it one more time. I will show it again. Number two. Uh, sure. Yeah. Sure. Okay. There are two sneak peeks on here for these are December sneak peeks, you guys. These are December sneak peeks. December sneak peeks. So, hmm. Hmm, you're gonna have to do some detective work on that one. Hmm. Something exciting Something there, right? You never know. You never know. Okay. Um, I lost this. Okay, so see all my thanks guys go in here. They go where the words go. Uh, the fold it. See, the envelope for the fold it. Putting those away too. Tiff would be so proud of me. Were okay. you using some storage envelopes recently that were you showing something? Uh, this size for the fold it, this is the medium size. This is the medium. Uh, the one I, this is the medium stamps of life. The one that I have my words in, so this is my Thanksgiving, the one I have my words in is the stamps, I'm sorry, is the Tiffany. I think it's called six by nine, six by nine. Medium, I call medium. So six by nine or medium envelope is what I was using. The smaller one is the small one. Okay, I hope that answers. I don't know, sometimes I worry. Okay, um, I love that ribbon. Ooh, yeah, isn't that pretty? Um, let's see. Oh, Susan says the bee is going to buzz off. Yep, it is. It's going to be gone. It's going to be gone. Frank and Sharon. I got to meet Frank and Sharon. They, well, they, they finally made it home. You they think? made it. Oh, yeah, they're home. They're home. I, I read, I heard, I talked to them. I mean, I saw them. Um, they drove down from Portland area to come see us. They did some other, they just like maybe some family stuff, whatever, <laughs> whatever. But they came down to see us, which was very exciting. Mm -hmm. um, she says, th they say, thank you so much for all you, both of you do. We're sitting here opening up our happy mail while watching you. Yay! You guys are gonna have some fun with that stuff. Um, let's see, I love that. Uh, six by nine tab pocket. Thank you, Gloria, thank you. Happy Thanksgiving to you, Margaret. So I'm gonna see you guys Sunday. So we'll, we'll do back. all our Thanksgiving then. We'll do all our Thanksgiving then. But we are late and Kenny and I gotta go. But my friends, wow. thank you. Thank you so much for your love, your support and your prayers. You guys, you have no idea how much they mean to us. And that's why we love to throw those freebies at you guys um, just because you know, it's our way of saying thank you. And I wish I could go to each and every one of your homes and give you a hug, but I can't. So I feel like this is the ne next best thing by giving you free stuff. So 
Thank you. Yeah, we appreciate all of you. So yeah, much. if somebody could do me Thank a favor you. and post on the fan page about the Ken freebies for the card kit starting mm. in December for yeah. the next five months, I'd appreciate that. Um, I would love that very much. And if you've never heard of the Facebook fan page, go search Stamps of Life fan page and join the official Stamps of Life fan page because it is a positive, safe, happy place to be. Um, only positive ideas. vibes are allowed and uh, it's a, just a great, safe place to be and it's a really wonderful, fun place. We don't run it. A group of wonderful people run it for us. Um, they, ju they just volunteer their time and do it and it's just really awesome, but um, it's a great place to be. So, they, oh, Christine says your, your videos are uplifting. Bless you both. Well, thank you. So, good night to you all. Stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy, and I will see you Sunday. Five o'clock Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. Ah, go. <laughs> it's done.